Fix error code 0x8000 FFFF when starting Windows 10 Store. First of all, ensure that you are logged in on your computer using your Microsoft account AND. Make sure that the driver for your installed components are updated. Solution 1. built-in Windows Store apps troubleshooter. Solution 2, Step 1, Reset the app in the Windows settings. Go to Settings System Apps and Features Store Advanced Options Reset. After doing the troubleshooting steps, please restart your computer. Step 2, if the issue persists kindly click on Install. If the above Step 2 did not work for you, back up your current system DNS setting, then change it to Google's public DNS. Meantime, create a user account in Windows. Once done, log into your computer using the new account. Solution 3, works for Phone like Lumia 930 with latest RS1 Fast Ring Insider Build Step 1, check whether the date and time is correct in settings. Also, you can change the region for Windows Store in settings. Install all pending updates on the phone. See more tips at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash Step 2, back up or export your personal data, perform a reset on your phone. Disclaimer, resetting your phone will erase all content stored on your phone, including apps and games, along with app data and game progress, text messages, call history, music, photos, and more. Solution 4, Step 1, Reset Windows Store Cache by running osreset.exe. Step 2, It does not help, try disabling any active proxy, proxy server, in Internet Explorer. Step 3, Windows Store Apps Troubleshooter. Step 4, if you are using third-party security software, try disabling third-party security software or, perform a clean boot. Note number 1, if you have
temporarily disable it to install or run other software, you should re-enable it as soon as you're done. If you're connected to the internet or a network while your antivirus software is disabled, your computer is vulnerable to attacks. Note number 2, this action would require the admin access. Step 5, use the system file checker tool, sfc slash scano. See details at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash sfu21x. Step 6, run the below two commands as the admin user. dism.exe slash online slash cleanup image slash scan health dism.exe slash online slash cleanup image slash restore health note number 1. The tool might take 15 to 20 minutes to finish running, so please do not cancel it. Note number 2, if you too met error 87 while running dism slash online slash cleanup image slash restore health, follow this fix at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash zq7yye. Step 7, go to the following location at c colon backslash users backslash user underscore name backslash app data backslash local backslash packages backslash microsoft dot windows store underscore 8 way keb 3 d 8 bbwe backslash local cache in your computer. Delete all the files and folders in that folder. Relaunch Windows Store app. Tip, please make sure to change user underscore name to your own PC name or username. Step 8, check if the automatic update of your system is currently running and enabled. Further, run the Windows Update Troubleshooter. Step 9. Uninstall and reinstall the Windows Store app using the PowerShell command. 9.1. Type get ups package Windows Store remove ups package. 9.2. Type get ups package all users for each add ups package disable development mode register dollar, dollar underscore dot install location, backslash ups manifest dot xml. Step 10. Reset your windows. Solution 5. Try the 1024x768 screen resolution. 1. Right click the mouse from the desktop interface and select display settings display advanced display settings. 2. Check the screen resolution shown there. It should be at least 1024x768. Also, make sure the user account control, UAC, is enabled in the computer.